Hey, this is Patrick, the owner of Geochron. So yesterday was the spring equinox. Nope. Hey, this is Patrick, the owner of Geochron. So yesterday was the fall equinox, March, September. Nope. <laughs> hey, this is Patrick, the owner of Geochron. And yesterday, nope. This is Patrick, the owner of Geochron, and yesterday one of our very smart customers called us up and he said, I've got a Geochron and it is the fall equinox, but the shadows that show the event horizon of the sun are not straight up and down. They're like a little bit like this. They seem to be about 24 hours off, which set off a whole round of discussions around here, leading me to call the business partner of the guy who invented the clock who lives down in San Francisco. And we found the answer. It's down here on this blueprint. So you can see here that the autumn equinox, it should be straight up and down. But yesterday was September 22nd, and it was not straight up and down. That's because the geochron is built mechanically linked so that the autumn equinox occurs on September 23rd. And you may say, well, that's the wrong date. Well, that's not true because in 1992, down here, here, in 1992, when the map was made, the, made, uh, the autumn equinox was September 23rd. So look over here. March 21st is our vernal equinox. September 23rd is the autumn equinox, but yesterday it was September 22nd. So this is a little bit beyond my pay grade, but the rotation of the Earth wobbles a little bit due to the gravitational effect of the moon, and the equinoxes can vary as much as 24 to 36 hours over the centuries. So the clock is right, for 1992, and it's going to be right in the future, but it's not always going to be dead on because it is a machine, and that's part of the beauty of the clock, is it's a machine. It's not some digital thing. It has a life. It breathes. It works. And so if you have a geochron, your autumn equinox is going to be on September 23rd, which is today. And as a matter of fact, all our geochrons are out here, are on September 23rd, straight up and down. And that's the mystery of the geochron.